would share this with you really quickly. I did a Walmart kind of filler shop. It's the next day. So I shared my Sam's haul with you yesterday. I haven't even finished putting it away and that's where I'm at. So, so many Christmas prep things happening here. Super busy and it's late once again. It's like 8.30 almost. So, oh my goodness. And you'll hear kids running around, probably some bluey in the background <laughs> because again, this is just where we're at and children, mom life. So you're going to hear them playing probably. All right. Christmas, New Year's, punch is happening, <laughs> ginger ale, some cranberry juice, and hmm, that must have been a substitute because that's supposed to be grape juice, but that is okay. So we make our own punch. It just goes a little bit farther. So all of the punch making things, some parchment paper, Christmas cookie baking is happening this week in our gingerbread houses. We make all those by scratch. So that is coming up on the list. And tater, I got tater tots and they told me that they were out. So they substituted it with these and yet here they are. So I only ordered one, not sure what happened there. Probably paid for both, no clue. So <laughs> there's that icing, they were out of the green icing. My children do not like the royal icing. They have informed me they like this on their cookies. They like to just get it out and decorate their cookies with these. So that is fine by me. We got the great value vanilla. The red, I'll probably make one of these into green since they were out. So well, we will have a Christmas cookie decorating night and they are so excited by that. Light brown sugar cookies and some corn starch because I couldn't find any in my pantry. So I think we're out. So just in case I grab some of that. Easy peasy lunch for a crowd since busy, busy this week. <laughs> so that, some whipped topping for all the cocoa that's going to be happening. A big pack of frozen dinner rolls, we love those. A stocking stuffer for the husband and that is also a good tip. This is a trendy gift slash even stocking stuffer this year for anyone in your life, $29. You can get them at Amazon, Walmart, Target, wherever you can find them, because I know they're going fast. They come in packs of four as well, but a pack of one is, like I said, a really good stocking stuffer. So I have that. I'll link it below if you were having trouble finding some. All right, and then we have some Texas toast, some flour tortillas with breakfast burritos in mine, or this actually might end up being an enchiladas for dinner. Some carrots for a lamb roast on Christmas. And then some coffee to top off our coffee pods. There they are. There are the munchkins running around laughing. <laughs> some more hot cocoa. I got the big, um, it's a one pound thing. This is only like 370, this big tub and my children love it. It is cocoa season in this house. So <laughs> that, and then some kombucha because my niece is coming from Australia and her mama told me that that is her favorite. So I'm gonna put it in her fridge at the cabin where she will be staying with us. And two loaves of bread, some kale, probably going to be garnish around a Christmas roast and bananas for the monkeys. Would you believe they already ate all of the bananas that I have bought this week? And I bought a lot of bananas. <laughs> so there's some more, another gallon of milk, um, some breakfast sausage, some pizza crust, breakfast pizza happening. That's one of my children's favorites. I've shared that recipe for you in a video. They absolutely love it. So easy, something different, crowd pleaser. Um, we need two for our family of eight. And the sausage is probably going to be going towards pizza pasta, one of my children's favorites. And then my little one is trying to get out of diapers, but she's not there yet. And we don't usually get parents' choice, but I feel like they are better than they used to be. I got some recently. This is just a little $5 pack for 32, and I was impressed with them. So, eh, that's good. So I got those. Then, over here, Corn dogs, again, easy lunch, but also with my Australian niece coming, they call these Pluto Pops and they are a rarity in Australia. So I thought that was very American of us. So we got that. A few little Tide Pods to top off my jar so we don't get too low. All of the pasta sauce, just so I don't have to make it easy peasy in the pantry. And some Annie's macaroni because we are always putting that in the pantry some red enchilada sauce because I have an enchiladas coming up. Again, 
very American of me, <laughs> and some hot dog buns for an easy lunch or dinner. And then Berkshire's is having a sale on hams. I think it's like a, yeah, $1.49 a pound. So this was a $10 ham, and this is a $9.82 ham. So really good, you have to slice them yourself, but that is okay. It is smoked and cooked and yay. So I'll probably be cooking one of those for Christmas alongside a lamb roast and saving one for a rainy day. Guys, that is it. That was a mouthful, but this is the little Walmart shop to keep us going. And to top off the Sam shop, there are some things you just can't buy at Sam. Some of the bits and bobs. Whipped topping is another very American thing. They did not have this in Australia, so I wanted to make sure that we had that. And that is it, guys. There are the Indians <laughs> screaming in the background. All right, guys. Until next time, have a very merry Christmas season. And I hope you are eating all of the beautiful things with your family as well. Bye.